When Jim Barker called wideout Maurice Mann to ask him if he'd like to join the Argonauts for the third time, he jumped at the opportunity. In fact, after spending the past year away from the CFL, he couldn't have said yes fast enough. He t- told me, Mo, you know, are you interested in playing football? If you can, if you are, then come down here at 2 o'clock. And I think I left five minutes later to wait <laughs> till 2. Mann played a big part in the Argos 2012 Grey Cup run, including a team leading seven receptions and a touchdown in the Eastern Division semifinal. Originally brought back to the practice roster, Mann has since been put into the starting lineup due to various injuries, and he's relishing the opportunity. You know, man, they come so, so, so scarcely, so, you know, it was really important, man, for me to be ready, which I was, and thank goodness, right, because I got thrown in the fire super early. I, I love a challenge, so um, it was more exciting to actually not have to wait than to go out there and actually just play. Um, you know, I just really love, though, the fact of being challenged, and that's everything that I could ask for. He spent his year off coaching in the International Developmental Fast Football League, a youth football program that teaches kids to learn the game and compete without pads. Suddenly jumping back into the Argos starting lineup with little notice would be a difficult transition for most, but luckily for Mann, he's had multiple stints playing with Ricky Ray behind center. A good quarterback makes a great though receiver, so I mean, simple as that, right? Uh, Ricky, Ricky was the easiest reason for me to come back because I knew his, his his attention to detail, how hard he studies, and how you know, and how well he prepares himself though to be ready. So all I had to do was uh, run hard, catch the ball, and try to make a few plays. Mann led the team in receptions and receiving yards in his first game back against the Rough Riders on Saturday. Heading into Friday's matchup against Montreal, he plans to remind everyone just how dangerous he can be in the open field. My goal is to be the best man receiver in this league. Simple as that. I mean, I'm not here, though, to be no substitute. I mean, I'm here to play football and absolutely give it my all as long as they need me, right? And um, I'm just happy, though, to really be here. Although Maurice was originally signed as a replacement once the Argonauts receiving core was bit by the injury bug, he says he plans to stick around once the injured players come back. And if his game against Saskatchewan on Saturday is any indication, Scott Milanovic will have a very difficult decision to make once they do. For Argos TV, I'm Gareth Bush.